Hello everyone, my name is Ko. My name is Petri. We are May. Today we're going to have a new guest from Indonesia. Petri, mm -hmm. could you introduce yourself? All right. My name is Petri. I'm working for Chemistry Department, Indonesia University of Education in Bandung. Okay. Let me put this question to you before okay. starting my video mm -hmm. clip. So my axis and the next axis. I just keep a straight line. Can you talk about equation? Y. Y. Equal to A. Right. It's very simple. What about this one? Y. X. And this curve. Y. Y. Equal to A X square plus B X plus C. And the B and C here plus be B zero. Must be zero. And what about this curve? Y X. Yes. Energy potential well. The last electron. Hmm. That smooth curve. I have no idea for the equations. Mm -hmm. Should be complicated for the equations. Yeah, that's true. The like us today, mm -hmm. more than 300 years ago, many scientists attempt to understand what is this curve. Mm -hmm. One of them, Taylor's, then proposed a sum of polynomial. Mm -hmm. So, assuming the function is smooth enough mm -hmm. and then differentiable. Taylor series and then equation will be this way. Sigma yeah, and zero, zero infinite, infinite and then n factorial f n f n a a x minus minus a n. Mm, seems not so simple, <laughs> the equation. To simplify further, mm -hmm. McLaurin proposed his new series in them. Ah, we can call this McLaurin, McLaurin series. series. It's a kind of Taylor series of expansions of about zero. Yes. So, in this case, and then A will be zero. zero. So once again fx n zero n zero infinite n factorial n h zero h zero x two x two n. Mm. Cool. Yes. Taylor and McLaurin were the famous scientists at the time. Right? Uh, they're great scientists in mathematics. It's true. Mm -hmm. Do you know when they died? Mm, late forties. Late forties. Mm, they died young. Seems got like very smart scientists. So I think we can live longer, right? <laughs> More than hundred? Come on, <laughs> make it easy. Uh, okay. I will focus on my presentation. <laughs> So uh, that's why, and then we just stretch this equation and the fx. Ta, n is zero. Zero factorial is just one. Mm -hmm. So the first term should be f zero. F zero plus n is one. One factorial. One factorial. F one. F one. And then x one. X one plus, plus two factorial. Two factorial. F two. Two. X2. X2. And then less of these things, we can expect that. I see. But now I would like to express mm -hmm. in this one. So a change into E energy. E energy. X become delta X. Delta X displacement. Mm -hmm. This is constant. Mm -hmm. So I want to give some constant E A. E A. And plus one pectoral is one. One pectoral is one. So, the e mm -hmm. over dx. The x become delta, delta x. x. And two pectoral is two. Two. D 
This means this one, three and four and five. Negligible, right? Yes. Mm -hmm. Too small to be neglected. I see. So we didn't consider this term anymore. Ah, could you remember the relationship between force and energy? Force and energy. We did it last video call. Oh, you didn't. You didn't see that video call Sorry, before. Sorry, I yeah. missed your video, the last video. I had that thing. One but question. Did you subscribe my video? I promise. Channel? I will. After this. I'm very disappointed. <laughs> Come on, take it easy. Okay. So, the force. We express as E delta x and this power and then we just get at minus minus s minus means in some direction that because the force is a vector I see. so this whole equation divided by this one okay it's constant that's why it becomes zero. zero this one represents this part so slow also, zero. zero. Not to be considered. Yeah. So, only term we have in this equation, this one. So, two, two, zero. and then the final equation. Three. Three. Yes. Three x. X. Square. Yes. Mm -hmm. Delta x. This is the force. This is displacement. Mm -hmm. That's why this part should be ah Young's modulus. That's true. Correct. It's ah. elastic uh, Young's modulus. So this is the origin of Young modulus. Yeah, you're right. Young's modulus. Mm -hmm. So today we are successfully drive the Young's modulus. And then tomorrow I'm going to talk about mm -hmm. the relationship between several physical parameters mm -hmm. in material science engineering using the Young's modulus concept mm -hmm. and energy potential well. Alright. Okay, you guys uh, see you. See you.